welcome back to the Outer Worlds. Back on the old Unreliable. We are currently working through Perils on Gorgon. And Peril on Gorgon just up the ante. Because now the quest line has taken us back to Byzantium, the place where I am severely hated. You are kill on sight <laughs> to this faction. Vendor prices are increased by 50%. So now we have to go down to Byzantium and they hate us and I think let's see are we are we, are we near okay we got to go here which means we got to fight our way through this whole area here I did a little recon um, I could fast travel here but that's kind of just drops you right in the middle of the shit this is the ship this is because I'm at President Akande's, I believe we're at President Akande's landing pad. That's where we went to. It's the HRC. We're over here on the landing pad. So we're going to go down in to here and work our way through here to get to here. I don't know what's here. But this is the, what's his name, the chairman's house here. So this whole area is just full of guards and bots. The the, uh, the garden bots will take us on too. So for this little trip, I did a little reconnaissance off camera just to see what I'm up against. Everything is way lower level than we are. And I was going to check out something here. Uh... I guess I sold the weapon I was just thinking I wanted. <laughs> what is this here? The mind control ray. That might be kind of handy. For what it's worth. The gloop gun. I don't think any of these are going to help us out. I was looking for my... Uh, my light machine gun. But I sold it. I really didn't think I needed it. Now it would have been a good time to have it. So we're going to have to go with what we got. I hope I've repaired everything up to 100%. This is pristine. How about that? That's pretty good. This is 100%. This is 100%. Everything's 100% now, right? This is 99.7. All right, so we don't have the machine gun. I thought I had it still. That would have been good for just mowing down people. All my weapons are, this is level 37. I can't tinker this up anymore. I can't tinker this up anymore. This is level 35. That was level 37? Really? Oh. This is only level 35. I must, not, I must have run out of money for tinkering this. This is level 35. That's 37. That's level 30. I must have run out of tinkering money. Let's see. Or I just didn't want... Just didn't want to tinker it up anymore. Yeah, this is three grand for this one. Well, this one's as high as you can go. Where's my bolter pistol? That's five grand. I need like a bolter pistol 3.0. This is 37. These are as high as they can go. And this is four grand to tinker this one up. But I'm not going to tinker up the weapons. I'm really not using that much. But I think we're going to try the N-Ray. Because that has a area of effect. That, where are we at? We're at a gentleman at Condi's landing pad. That has an area of effect on it. So we'll see how that works. Here we go. All right, this area is clear because we whacked all these guys and it just stays clear, I guess, because we whacked Hakande and all her. 
That is so funny. I didn't realize that that sound was the workbench. Yeah, I wonder how many people knew that. <laughs> so everybody up here is whacked. Everybody on this level. Um, just out of curiosity, let's see. What do we have armor-wise? I could really use some more armor. This armor is oh, this only level 16. And I think my armor is pretty good right now. Yeah, ooh, that's 108. That's level 35 armor, 108. Wow. Holy crap. Um, uh, that might come in handy. Hmm, thinking about this. These people are low level, but it's just a mob. It's going to be a mob scene. So I gotta try and figure out how to deal with it. What's my armor? My armor is currently 36 and 15. And that would be 108. But see, I'm getting a lot of damage out of my guns here. Um, what other armor do I have? This is 35. Stealth. I've thought about stealthing through this. I don't think I can. I don't think I can stealth through here. Well, let's just go with what we got. Let's just go with what we got. I gotta take this elevator down. Right? Yeah, this elevator goes down. I can't get in here. I don't know. Well, this is not a way in. This doesn't go anywhere. That's 150 XP. There's no way out of here that I know of. Uh, that's the chairman's office there or whatever. This is a Conde's. She's still lying here, stinking up the place. Um, yeah, there's no back door out of this at all. This doesn't go anywhere. This is just closed up. We can't get in that way. Okay. Alright. Well, here we go. Take the elevator down. Let's switch weapons. Um, this is my bolter pistol. Yeah, let's switch this to the bleed. This is pretty quiet. This is my quiet weapon. Alright, we gotta go down. Right down. Yep. Alright, here we go. We're going in. don't know if I can stealth anything outside the building. I can't stealth in here. It's too... It's too jam up in here. Fine citizens will not attack you. 
they're listed as enemies because everybody in Byzantium hates me. I could whack everybody, I guess, but as long as they're not going to attack me. All right, so now... All right, so the bleed pistol just didn't cut it. Let's put the bolter pistol back on. Put this back on. Um, assault rifle ultra. I need an assault rifle. A dead eye assault rifle too. Okay, we don't need these. All right. Now, what would my... Let me see. This does 210 damage. This does 382. So we'll stick with that. We won't use the corrosive one just yet. And let's try the N-Ray. Do a quick save here. Here we go. Where do I want to go? I know I can't fast travel. Let's see where I want to go. I gotta go through these guys to get to this next area. Okay, so how many guys we got here? Quite a few, eh? Let's see. There's two right here. I wonder if I can get these guys with the with the hammer. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I can't sneak past these guys. I gotta go through there. And this weapon has no silencer on it. And there is a mech down there, which I think he might participate, but I'm not sure. All right, let's just go for it. So the mech does not get involved. Okay, where's this guy at? What's this guy doing here? Okay, that clears this area. Not too bad. Only needed... Oh wow, this dusts them too, huh? Okay. That's weird. Wasn't expecting that, but... That goes to the... The tunnels, or the underground, the sewers, what is this? Maintenance tunnels. That was kind of a tricky thing. Because I could fast travel there, from the landing pad. But once I was there, and in, in the, uh, I didn't transfer to this. I could transfer right down to here. Maintenance tunnels. You could fast travel there. But once you're in the maintenance tunnels, you can't fast travel out. And the maintenance tunnels only got me, like, I think here. Got me in the wrong place. All right, so, again, the N-Ray worked kind of good. It was okay. How many guys did we draw in from out here? Did everybody run? Don't see any drones. Let's do a quick save. We might have drawn in quite a few guys from out here. There's a few red dots, but we don't know who they are. citizens I 
Oh wait, there's two guards there. There's a guard there. There's a guard there. Let's just uh, snipe these guys. Is the little puppy going to get me? Better not. That's all I got to say. Okay, we seem to be pretty good. The citizenry are just not going to do anything. There's a red guy over there. Is that a... Yep, there is. Let's just take them all out, because I don't want anything to do with any of them. drone? Is that what it said? No, we want to go this way. Where was the other guy at? Did we get his stuff? Yeah, we got him. He's right there. Okay, so the little garden drones don't get involved. Good. Don't bite me, Did little dog. What do you think you're doing? Intimidate whatever I want. Day. I say, I haven't seen more tents in a while. No great loss, if you ask me. That woman was always sitting on her bed. All right, so we're going this way. Okay, that's a citizen there. There's going to be more guards down here somewhere. A wealthy citizen. All right, where are the guards at? An ad drone, not an art drone. It's an ad drone. Okay. I can't tell if there's a guard. There should be a guard there by the front door. Right? Yeah. Just whack his ass. <laughs> um, is he the only one? He might be. We don't need to go in there now. Let's grab this stuff over here. All right, let's go in here. This may not be an accessible place until you do the uh, DLC. I didn't notice it before. Uh, let's put on my dialogue suit, what I have left of it. 
Uh, persuade. We have a persuade hat, don't we? We have an intimidate. Termination. Two-handed melee. I have two persuades. I think I have a persuade. Where is my persuade? I have a persuade or intimidate suit. And a stealth skills. What's my stealth skills entail? That doesn't have nothing to do with... Yeah, with dialogue. So, I thought I had an Intimidate helmet. Where is it? Hack. I have Temperament. You know, that kind of does, that covers everything. Intimidate. Oh, there it is. Oh, Persuade. So I don't have a Persuade hat. Oh, wait, that's this right here, dumbass. Alright, put that on and we'll put our... The best dialogue skills we got, Intimidate. This has a silver tongue kit on it, though, so... Alright, what do you got hey, for me? I know your face. You're wanted by the board. I am. What do you want to well, know about it? You're a living, breathing outlaw. That <laughs> is, until security outside gets their eyes on you, but let's not spoil the moment. Security's if you're gone. here for the annual Canid review, I'm afraid it's already over. Only thing going on behind those doors is good, old-fashioned, lawful behavior. Hmm. This greeting constitutes your confidentiality agreement. You hereby agree not to disclose the location or existence of these events. Thank you for cooperating. Hold on, I don't agree to anything. Then you should have told me that before I greeted you. <laughs> Defaulting on a verbal agreement is a punishable offense. Now then, how can I help you? What's with all the secrecy? This place isn't exactly hard to find. We find that our clients enjoy the appearance of participating in illegal activities. Secrecy contributes to a feeling of indecency. <laughs> the Musgrave family collection was intended to be a gallery of fine art. And here we are, using this place to practice semi-legal canid shows. Scandalous, isn't it? Perception. You said this place was supposed to be an art gallery. What happened? That's privileged information. I really shouldn't tell you. Oh, uh, yeah? Sure you can. I already agreed to your stupid... Con <laughs> didn't, I didn't agree. That's a fair point. All right. I'll tell you. But just keep this between us. The Musgraves own one of Earth's largest private collections of art and literature. They were going to have the entire collection shipped all the way to Halcyon. Unfortunately, that collection never arrived. We haven't heard anything from the delivery convoy, and there's some purely hypothetical concern that the collection might be, well... Lost? I was going to say indefinitely delayed by unforeseen and unknowable circumstances, but yes. Let's go with that. Anyway, that's as much as I can tell you. Will there be anything else? Yes, I'm looking for Clarence Mostly. Mr. Mostly is indeed attending our event, although I am disappointed to discover he did not officially enter his canid Laplace into our competition. You should find Mr. Mosley just inside the prep room. Head inside and take the door to your left. Okay. Is this all steel? It is not. Ah, here's a locked one, though. Uh, what's in there? Anything good? Oh yeah, bit cartridge. Yeah, we'll take that. Didn't mind that, did you? Okay. Ah, uh, there's a vending machine, so let's get rid of some stuff. I don't need this. This is my persuade, right? This is leadership skills and persuade. Okay. this 
We don't need any more weapon parts, we just need cash. Uh, yeah, we'll just take the cash in this case. We got 219 weapon parts, that's pretty good. This is good. Mind, we'll keep mind because I seem to be short on mind attributes, personality attributes I don't need right now. I'll probably need it at some point in time. Armor rating plus 10. Um, yeah, 23 seconds, huh? We'll keep that just in case later on down the road. We don't need it now. What is this? Weapon, attack speed, and mind attributes. Critical damage, we're keeping that. Tactical time, we're keeping that. I know what I want to get rid of. I want to get rid of some Adrena time. We're going to get rid of 123 of those. we we'll just keep 100 up for now. Actually, let's get rid of 150 of them. That's pretty good. And I have an extended site. That's it. Okay, let's go sell this stuff. Not sure where this guy's at, but uh, let's see. Augmented toughening. Leper leaper <laughs> injectors. Keep saying leper injectors. Alright, where's this guy at? He's over there, okay. Oh, here's something else we can steal. Let's see who gets excited about this. This is level four. Or I need four. But let's just go with lockpick. Where is it? Here we go. Lockpick. And stealth. Okay, didn't bother anybody. Back to my hat. And my intimidate suit. Where's that here? Yep. Okay. We gotta go on that side, huh? We wanna go down where the dogs are? Seem to be anything happening down here. People just looking at frickin' canids. What's over there? There's a door I can open. Let me check it out. Golden Canid Trophy. Ah, we should just take that. We're probably gonna get tasks with taking that, I'm sure. Um, where does this go? Don't know. But might just go up to the next floor. Okay, so there's a golden canid trophy there. Um, I don't know how you get in there. Here, maybe. Yeah, there's a way in there, I guess. Or probably got to come from another direction. All right, let's go talk to this guy. I'm guessing he's going to want us to steal the trophy in order to help us. We've been over this before. It's terrible. Canid hunting is the natural evolution of Canid shows. All right, let's go talk to this dip. Uh, there he is. Yeah, he's definitely gonna want us to steal something. Do you know the interesting thing about Canid shows? Um. I'm interested in anything involving canids. Trick question. There isn't anything interesting about canid shows. No, but I have a feeling you're about to tell me anyway. <laughs> Here we go. Good instincts. Mathematically speaking, the interesting thing about canid shows is this. They're an exercise in futility. Winning is predetermined. Over time, the inevitable trend is that the race goes to the swift. Time and chance are just statistical outliers. Hmm. In other words, if you put enough canids through enough trials, 
the one with the most optimal attributes generally wins. Exercise in futility. Are you Clarence mostly? What gave me away? Wait, don't tell me. You've read my monograph, putting the us in calculus, or <laughs> how to use mathematics to find your statistically significant other. I'm afraid no. I don't really do autographs, but yes, I am Clarence Mostly. Intelligence. That name sounds familiar. Mostly free, mostly fine furniture company, right? Yes, that's us. Mostly oak trees, too. My grandfather invented them, you know. <laughs> well, no, he didn't invent mostly oaks, but he did purchase the naming rights back during the terraforming days. It's essentially the same thing. I've been looking for you. You're the last known staff member of Project Gorgon. Oh. <clears throat> then you're not here about my monograph. It's hmm. true. I was involved with Project Gorgon, but that chapter of my life is long since closed. Listen. Hmm. Let's see. I don't know what you want with Gorgon or with me, but let me give you some free advice. Hmm? Let the past go. Live in the moment. Enjoy the party. The manufactory is on emergency lockdown. I need you to help me lift it. You're a bit late. Some mysterious figure already sent me cryptic warnings. Uh, what got you... What got you so frightened? You want to keep living in the moment? Show me how to lift the emergency lockdown. There we go. We're going to go with that one. I was wondering if you were the sort of person to accept sensible advice or respond with threats of violence. Thank you for resolving that ambiguity for me. <laughs> Lifting the lockdown won't be easy. You'll need to send overrides from the chem lab and human inquiry. I don't have that level of clearance, but I know two people who do. Hmm. The trouble is, I don't know you. I don't trust you. I washed my hands of Gorgon, and you're asking me to dirty them all over again. I'm going to need a good reason. I was hired to find a journal. I'm just trying to do my job. Something horrible happened on Gorgon. I'm trying to uncover the truth. Intimidate. How's this for a reason? I'm really heavily armed. Project Gordon created marauders. You can't just walk away. No, no, we're going with the hell because I'm, I'm like, I, everybody hates me here, so we're going with this one. Right, of course. Thank you for reminding me. Point well taken. I want a favor from you. Do something for me, and I'll do something for you. That way, we don't have to rely on mutual trust. A grand prize trophy to the Canid Review. I want it in my hands. Get me that trophy, and I'll give you the remaining researchers. Names, locations, as much information as I have. Hmm. What's important about the trophy? I'm pretty sure the Canid Review is already over. Uh, yeah, let's go with this one. My Canid, Laplace, is statistically superior to every other Canid in this review. Better average sprinting time, superior gait coefficient, optimal anatomical symmetry. <laughs> I didn't bother entering little Laplace in this pointless contest. He's already won on paper, you see. That yeah. trophy rightfully belongs to him. That might be the most Byzantium thing I've ever heard. Oh, you're much too kind. Does this mean you'll do it? Sure, we'll go get your trophy. Go to the main hall and take the elevator down into the maintenance tunnels. You'll find a service passage that leads up into the trophy room. The maintenance tunnel is the only way up into the trophy room. Some technician barred the door shut on our end. Ask Tilda Coatsworth about it, over by the podium. Okay, you just wait here. Tilda? All right, we gotta talk to Tilda by the podium. She's right here. That's not Tilda, is it? Oh yeah, it is. This is a private party. No solicitors, no vagabonds, no freelancers. If you're here to offer your services as an entertainer, we're not interested. I was actually here about the Canid Review. It's a nice looking trophy you've got over there. You're all degenerates and I hope the building collapses on you. Now you see, if I had, if I still had my, my dialogue suit that I didn't sell, it would probably be a different response because that's a Jacqueline Originelle or whatever the hell her name was. Um, I was actually here about the review. Unfortunately, you're too late. 
The review ended a few days ago. We've submitted our results to the Judiciary Committee and await arbitration. Huh. In eight to ten short weeks, we'll have the name of a winner. <laughs> Probably. That gives <sighs> us eight to ten weeks to file a maintenance request. Our technician barred the vault door and then disappeared without a trace. Can you believe that? What was your technician doing in the vault? Unbelievable. Whatever happened to competent help? Let's go this one. Now you're speaking my language. The Musgrave Vault contracted a security consultant from UDL. They sent a technician to install a few security upgrades, anti-dissident auto-mechanicals and the like. That technician barred the vault but neglected to leave us with a way in from here. He wasn't seen leaving the security room, so I can't imagine where he's gone off to. I see. Isn't there another way into the trophy room? What about the maintenance tunnels? The tunnels are guarded by auto-mechanical security. I don't look nearly boorish enough to resemble a UDL guard, so they'd probably shoot me on sight. In any case, I'd rather not step foot in the tunnels. The tunnels are for disposing of unwanted refuse, and no place for a respectable Byzantine. I can find a way in for you. You won't have to dirty your hands. Your eagerness to serve your betters is commendable. Here's a key card. There we go. It should help you get around inside the tunnels. Now, was there anything else? I'd like to get back to mastering over the ceremonies, or people might question why I have this role at all. <laughs> all right, you gotta hit the elevator. We're gonna call the video here and we'll, we'll pick it up right from here. Another freaking workbench. So, if you're watching, thanks for watching. See you.